What's up you guys? Welcome to my law school nighttime routine. If you're new here, my name is Kate and I'm a 1L in law school. So this is my first year and I kind of just thought it would be fun to show what a typical night in my life looks like. Tomorrow I have four classes so there's a lot of things to be prepared for and a lot of reading to do. So I kind of wanted to show what I do to prepare for that. But this night is actually a little bit different from a typical night in my life because I am prepping for a trip to Paris for spring break which is really exciting and before I go any further I do just want to say that I'm very thankful that I have the privilege of traveling for spring break and I've taken a lot of things into consideration given the climate of the world right now and I personally feel safe and secure to travel. This trip has been booked for a really long time now and me and my best friend have planned a lot for it and we're just really excited so I've been planning for that prepping a lot of packing and trying to figure out what I want to take but yeah other than that this is going to be a normal night I have to do homework I'm going to do my self-care routine I might do a little bit of painting and also just my regular errands so today I actually had four classes so I'm actually quite tired so when I get home, I typically like to take like an hour or two to eat and relax and de-stress from the day that I had. And then I will either do my errands or like household chores or I'll read. So it really just depends on how I'm feeling, which one I do first. Today, I think I'm just going to go ahead and read for my classes and knock it out of the, knock it out of the way so it's over with. So this is my homework set up. I have my book out that I'm going to start with. I'm going to do civil procedure first and then just my other notes and books that I will need while I'm sitting here doing my homework. So I've showed this in like all of my old videos but I thought I would show it again. This is how I keep track of everything. So here I have just these random little tasks that I need to do. And then here's everything that I need to have done for class tomorrow. So I have to read for civil procedure, which is about 12 pages. And then um, I need to read for property. And then thankfully I've been able to work ahead and I've already read for constitutional law and my contracts class as well. all of my homework done so it's time to move on to my errands and just little random tasks that I need to do around the house so first I do have to go to Target and get some snacks for my trip because we have really long flights and I just think it'll be better to be prepared so let's go to Target Okay, this is what I got. This is all just random household things that I needed. Um, well, honestly, not even need. Did I need this little $3 plant that I'm going to put in my shower? No, but I wanted it. 
Needed some body wash and then creamer, mouthwash, just some soups so that I have things to eat when I get back from my trip. And then this is what I got for my trip. Um, beef jerky, you can't go wrong with that. Gummy bears, this Tex-Mex trail mix to keep me full at the airport. Definitely gonna need a Celsius because we have to leave pretty early for our flight. And then I need a travel deodorant. And yes, I do get men's because women's just does not cut it sometimes. And then I got this luggage tag set um, because there's really nowhere to like, there's no little place to put a tag on my new luggage. So I did get this, that way I can fill out my information in case something were to happen to it. But yeah, light, light little Target haul. At this point in the night, after my homework is done, all of my errands are done, I do like to clean up around my house just because I find that when I wake up, to a clean house, I'm more motivated and it just sets the right tone for whatever I'm doing that day. I do have a morning routine, so go watch that after this video if you haven't seen it already. I kind of talk about how important it is to have a system and a routine that really works for you and for me that's doing little things the night before to make the next day easier. So I like to clean, um, like I have to do dishes for sure and I also need to do laundry so i'll get those done and then i also like to have an outfit picked out for the next day to just make everything go a little bit smoother in the morning and then i have my backpack pre-packed and ready to go so i might do like what's in my backpack what's in my law school backpack that might come later in this video but yeah the worst thing is when you get to class and you realize that you left a case book or something at home and you have to run back and get it in time for class and it's just not good to not be prepared if you get called on or something so that's kind of my system i'm gonna get to it and then after i get all of that stuff done that's when i do my self-care i shower um i try to do something creative like journaling painting or just like watching netflix or just something to like calm my mind down Okay, I have my house cleaned. A big reason why I wanted to clean a lot tonight is because I like to come home to a clean house on vacation. And tomorrow, I just know that I'm gonna be doing my little last minute packing things and I probably won't have much energy to clean. And we're leaving Friday, so I wanted to get all of my cleaning done tonight to make it less stressful tomorrow. Um, so that's why I did a little bit more cleaning than like I normally would on a school night. But it really does feel good to have a deep cleaned house. But that's done. Thank God. And now I need to get everything in order for class tomorrow. So I just packed my backpack. So I guess I could show you all what I keep in here. Um, I'm not going to show you everything that's in my backpack just because... There's a lot of random stuff. So first things first and most important, you need something to write with. A pen, these are my favorite ones. It's these Pilot G2s and then highlighters, millions of them. As many as you can fit into your backpack. And then AirPods, obviously, so you can jam out. And then I like these Post-it things. Um, they're just like these little tab things that you can put in your book and mark where you left off or important things that the professor points out. Also, I don't have this in here right now, but I usually do keep an umbrella and a water bottle that I can refill at school. And then obviously masks, you gotta have those. My school actually just lifted their mask mandate. So tomorrow is a busy day, which means I'm gonna need like all of my books. So property and civil procedure and then for my constitutional law class we don't have a textbook like 
you know, like an actual like hard copy. Um, he just sent us a PDF file of a book that he wrote. And so I just print out the unit that we're covering on any given day. And then obviously my MacBook, I recently upgraded. I had a MacBook Air since 2015 or 2016. And I just got a MacBook Pro um, last August. And I love it, very nice. So if you're in law school, you know, if you know, you know. This red book, um, Federal Civil Rules of Procedure. Uh, it's very handy, but it's also kind of scary. Um, we need it pretty much every single day in civil procedure. So as you can see, I have it totally tabbed up here so I can just flip the page. But Okay, last but not least, I have this five subject notebook, uh, which works really well because I have five classes. Um, so I just take all of my notes in this and I don't have to keep separate notebooks. So I have my backpack and my outfit all laid out for tomorrow for class. And then I have my little, um, tote bag ready that I'm going to take this to Paris just because I think it's going to be so convenient to have a big, um, like lightweight tote to carry around. And then I was going to go through and make sure I have all of my stuff in here but i'm actually waiting on a cider package that's going to come tomorrow and it has a few things that i really want to take and wear in paris so i'm hoping it makes it and i can put all of that stuff in here Okay, I'm cozy in my pajamas. I've done my hair care, skin care, all of that stuff is done. So now all that's left to do is relax and I'm gonna paint a little bit. I painted last night and honestly, like it was such a great stress relief. So I have all of my stuff here, just some brushes, a lot of paints, and then I don't have a proper like mixing plate or whatever so I just have this paper plate here and uh yeah I'm gonna watch Grey's Anatomy and try to paint something good fun I don't know 